Hey there guys, how's it going? It's Axel Bit here and we are continuing our let's play of Batman the Telltale's game series. And we are kicking off episode 4, Guardian of Gotham. So in the last part we were actually drugged by Vicky Vale who revealed herself to be Lady Arkham. Who seems to be the main villain of this story. So yeah, we were shipped off to Arkham as we can see here. I'm assuming that this character we see here in the preview images, Bruce with the handcuffs on being taken to Arkham with commission, uh, sorry, uh, Lieutenant Gordon watching over, he hasn't been made commissioner yet. Bruce and Batman must forge new alliances and fight old rivals to protect the innocents and keep Gotham from descending into chaos. So we'll jump straight in. you do it? Harvey needed you. Why save me? I haven't actually seen it yet. You've had me wrapped up this whole time. <laughs> Numbed beyond belief. Maybe it's not that bad. Our stock is tanking. The board is losing confidence. Wayne Enterprises needs a new face. Oswald Cobblepot. You're the only ally I have in this building. It's important. I need you to be my eyes and ears. All right, I can do that. Keep Oswald out of R&D. Let me know if anything comes up. You're a good man, Bruce. Please, Selina. I have to tell you how I... Bruce? should come stay with me. I'll think about it. Dropped your pen. That's not... <sighs> I think it's time you knew my real name. I am Lady Arkham. And now we in jail. Or you more think he is a mental ward asylum. Thanks for that bitch. You have to face the truth sometime. <laughs> Retribution, Bruce. Okay, I'm up. I'm up. <clears throat> well, for Christ's sake, put some clothes on. Doctor's making the rounds soon. Doctor? What doctor? Wow, okay, we are all kinds of fucked up. Rusty that cot. My blood. God, I hope it's mine. Well, I think you were lying on your back, so I'm assuming it would be, unless you started rolling around in it. Once you were done. Is that lens even open? Couldn't tell. It looked like it was closed. Look, designing the jumpsuit. Arkham Asylum. Yep. This can't be happening. Ooh, you're getting a bit of stubble there, Bruce, as well. We're not going to open the cell door. We'll have a look at the broken wall. Was that you? Or was that already broken? Looks like someone was angry. Lovely. So, either that was you or that was a previous inmate. Alright, looks like we're putting on the jumpsuit. Not gonna bother trying the door. We'll probably just be accused of attempting to escape. Evil. 
Oh, there's blood all over that bed. Okay, jeez, that's still in his system as well, just his entire right arm. Oh, how's his left arm looking? His left arm looks alright, but it's just the inside of his right. Okay, I guess we'll try opening. for rope before not really allowed to give it out of course I could make an exception for you I've seen a lot of people come through here the ones who stay quiet they're always the craziest can't tell how much danger they're in and boy are you in deep beating Oswald Cobblepot half to death isn't something you walk away from might as well get comfortable this is your home now time to meet your neighbor what the fuck is this? He sounded like he yeah, he sounded like he worked with Cobblepot when he said it. As you were. God damn it. You look just like him. Your father ever tell you about me? How he sent me here? Left me to rot in this goddamn hellhole? Somebody's gotta pay for that. I hope to God there is a hell. I want your daddy to see what I do to you. I am so sick of everyone blaming me for what my father did. I'm not him. Hurting me does nothing. Maybe not, but you're the next best thing, Wayne. Oh boy. Cool. God damn, that drug is still fucking kicking his ass. Something tells me we can't punch it out of his hand this time. Oh yeah, we're... Oh boy. God damn. Welcoming committee has really gone downhill around here, hasn't it? What the... Rude! Churlish! Not nice! How do you like it? You are pathetic! Oh boy. Oh, that's green hair. Oh boy. Buddy. Oh, buddy. Are you okay? You don't look so grand. More like the opposite. I... Thank you. I appreciate the help. You're welcome. If we don't look out for each other, who will, right? Can we be friends with What's the Joker? What's going on in here? It's like I told you, Doctor. These creeps were attacking the new guy. Well, who did that? Was it you? Of course not. It was mostly over by the time I got in. The new guy's tougher than he looks. Right, buddy? Bruce, <laughs> is that really what happened? Go on, tell her. I don't really know what happened. It was all a blur. Seems like you could have experienced another psychotic episode. We'll need to keep an eye on that. The orderly that was here before took money from these men and let them into my room. He gave them a taser. I knew that you coming to Arkham could cause some excitement, but I didn't expect it to happen so fast. I'll do my best to keep you safe, but I need you to be careful. <sighs> Us nice guys gotta stick together. Am I right? Thank you. I appreciate the effort. I'm glad you're so understanding after what just happened. Good thing help wasn't far away. Hey, I'm just looking out for the new guy. I'm Dr. Joan Leland, by the way, head of psychiatry. I'll be overseeing your case personally. We'll get you transferred to a new room, Bruce. One that doesn't have your blood all over it. For now, follow me. I'm sorry, I don't think I ever got your name. Me? <laughs> <laughs> He's never given his name out to anybody. What? We just call him John Doe. Bingo. <laughs> oh boy. I'm kind of liking this envelope where we can kind of become friendly with the Joker. That's that's a neat touch. I like that. Well, that was not a good start. Fucking John bastards coming. John is one of our in. most improved patients. He's been with us for quite some time. I'm sure he'd be willing to show you around. 
right, John? Oh, yeah. I'll show him the whole nine yards. <laughs> I think it would be best if you stayed by his side. There's not enough black tiles, you hear me? There's too many white tiles! I don't think he's synced up very well done. You know, Doc, our last session was so enlightening. That's good to hear. Your next evaluation is in a few weeks. I'm glad you're starting to understand yourself. Oh, <laughs> every day, Doctor. Why are you you leaning towards a door that's not good? Yep. I want a taste! Gotta be more careful, Bruce. Some of these guys bite. Why the fuck's this plate open? This viewing port or whatever. God damn. I could tell as soon as I was leading towards it. First time you let me into the rec room, Dr. Leland? <laughs> how could I forget? You had to teach me how to play checkers. Hey, I don't know how to play checkers. No, no you, you need to let me go. I have to warn the president. You're trying to kill me. You don't know the president. <laughs> they don't like it when you try to use the phone. That's because phones are for staff use only. No exceptions. <laughs> Stop that guy from trying. <laughs> Such persistence. Wrong number to this. Stop. I'll come by to check on you two later. Don't worry about us, Doctor Leland. Just make it take good care of him. Man, he's still creepy as hell, though. Even if he's trying to help us out for his own ends, or whatever, he might just be. Completely goddamn mad about it. Welcome to Arkham Asylum. <laughs> Believe it or not, some of these people are crazy. <laughs> oh, that's Blockbuster. But everyone's friendly, mostly. Unless there's more than one of them. I'd watch yourself around those two. Not a big fan of strangers. And just a little bit, you know, prone to outbursts of violence. Thanks for the heads up. I appreciate you showing me around like this. I'm a giver. <laughs> what can I say? I always try to keep an eye out for new guys. Let's see. On the couch, that's St. Louis. <laughs> Ooh, sh -sh -sh. His favorite show's on. Never misses it. Oh, good. White All snow. Right, friendo. Commercial break. Get up! <laughs> is the remote. One of the orderlies must have taken it. Never fear, though. I'll go ask Leland. She likes me. Okay. Cool. Ooh, I almost forgot. Here. What is this? Okay, so I'm now working with the Joker and he's given me a ancient key. For the cabinet? It's probably for the cabinet. Let's just have a quick look around and see. Chest. Or maybe it's for that. Okay, what's this then? No, uh, uh, Where's I could have sworn I saw a guard. Right, what's this guy? Billy. Hey Billy. You got a bad case of the mind knives. I can tell. I can tell. Just, just shove off. All right. No mind knives for me. I already got my shots. Dude, wait until I use my mind knives. You will not believe it. There's a station. Knock. Cool. Hey, uh, I was wondering about. It's not lunch yet. Well, actually, I it's wasn't. It's not time for meds either. Beat it. Okay, so there is a guy in here, but he doesn't seem to give too much of a shit. Um, I doubt the keys for that gate. The gate's too modern for that key. Um, try the cabinet, maybe. Not the right key for this. Okay. I'm going to assume it's for the chest. Uh, can we talk to those two guys? You, Arnold Wesker. I'm sure you're probably someone in the universe, but I don't know Batman or DC too well. Hello. 
Hello? Go away. Arnold. Busy. I swear, if you bother him, I will gut you. Um, ah, <laughs> I mean, I don't know, uh, okay. Nice trick. Listen, pal, Arnold's had a tough time in here, and he doesn't need bullies like you making his recovery harder. So unless you have something important to say, get lost. Can I at least apologize then? Oh, fuck, he's back hey already. There, buddy boy, you missed me, I missed you. Was that supposed to take that opportunity to open the chest? However, the threat remains. The children of Arkham are still out there, and I will not rest until these streets are safe and firmly under my control. And Never anything good on, is there? Wait, that's the move you're going to make, huh? Okay, so it looks like I've got a bit of time. We've got the chest, we've got St. Louis, let's talk to you a bit. I'm not really crazy, you know, in case you were wondering. No, don't worry, I'm not crazy either. Yeah, right. You wouldn't be here if you weren't. Yeah, don't point out the contradiction. Uh, sure. Right, okay, so he's called St. Louis because he thinks he's sane. At least I got that one. <laughs> oh. Batman really did a number on this guy. Just let him be. What's that? Not polite at all. At all. Sorry, I can't talk right now. I gotta keep my eye on this guy. Okay, so that must have been during the shooting at the electoral debates. Must have knocked him out or something, and the police managed to get a hold of him. All right, Victor Zaz, you along with? He cheats every time. He cheats. Sees what I'm thinking. Mind control. Cheater. I told you, if I could read minds, I certainly wouldn't waste my time on yours. Okay, so despite having mm -hmm. all the scars on him, he s seems to be. Bruce Wayne. You've got quite a reputation around here. Taking your enemies out to stay on top. I like your style, kid. Um. Sure. So, what's the deal with that? Well. This one was a homeless guy trapped in a hopeless life. <laughs> this was a woman who just couldn't stop cheating on her husband. This guy wanted to kill himself, but didn't have the courage. All lost souls that I free from their earthly woes. Okay, yeah, that's enough. Thanks. <laughs> Okay, so he thinks he's some kind of, I don't know, healer, killing people who want, who can't be helped in his eyes, I'm guessing. He can, seems to be able to talk fine, but he's still a bit loose. Okay. Sorry, he's a few screws loose. God damn, he's a bit loose. God, what a man -hole. Okay, look at the chest. Ooh. That still looks too modern. I'll try the key. Yeah, that doesn't look like it's gonna work. It doesn't work there. Alright, it's definitely not gonna work on the prison gate. I'm not gonna even try. So we'll keep hold of that just in case we need it later. Or should we hand it over to the orderly? Uh Huh. Damn. Uh, should we hand it over? Because if we get searched or anything, they see we've got a key on us. Mm, okay, we'll try it on the gate quickly. It 
No, oh, thanks for waiting, dude. What a nice guy. Hmm. Well, this key doesn't fit. What the hell is it for? Right, we'll keep a hold of it. Hopefully we won't need to use it at any point, uh, not use it, but hopefully we won't get searched at any point, and if we do, I suppose there's enough space up his arsehole for it. Uh, but we will call it an episode there, guys. So, this part, we've just been introduced to Arkham Asylum a bit. We got beaten up in our cell, and John Doe here, our good friend, came to help us out. And has now given us a key, which has left me with a bigger dilemma than I thought it would. So thank you very much for watching guys, and in the next part, we'll uh, talk to John Doe a bit more and hopefully figure out what the key is used for. So see you next time guys.